Hey, this is Grace. In this video, um, I'm going to talk about you know this, this whole situation I said I was going to give an update on. Well, here's the thing. Um, the situation got really bad for one of them. Uh, to me, it's bad. It might not, you know, nobody was physically harmed, but emotionally, mentally, maybe, yeah. Um, you know, this is this is a problem with people who are doing these parodies that they feel like they have, you know, freedom of speech and so they can say whatever they want to. Well, that's not 100% true. Although I thought some things had changed in 2017. I haven't been able to find that again, but you know, things like using fighting words, yeah, in the past, you couldn't. You're That's not covered. If you're doing something that's um, making the other person want to fight you or to, to have a fight, no, you know, in, inside of, not inside of, right, but a fight, yeah, those are not covered. But people, anyway, people think that they can say whatever they want to because they have freedom of speech, and then when it backfires on them, they, they, they still think they're in the right. What, what they, the things that they say are full of fight, full of fight. I mean, it's like, it's kind of, sometimes it's like bravado, um, you know, I don't know, mixed with a little bit of a, I don't know, I don't, a challenge, but it really comes off as a threat, okay? The com combination come off as a threat. And they think this that it's okay that they can say this, and everybody simply must accept the fact that they're saying all these things that are filled with hate, really, also filled with hate. That everybody should just laugh at it, think it's funny. You know, they call it a parody when it's not. And yeah, that everybody should be accepting of that. And if you're not, you have the problem. No, that's not true. These are some sometimes these this type. They believe that that's censorship and that, you know, they shouldn't be censored. <clears throat> well, yeah, maybe you should when you're throwing out hate speech. Yeah. And depending on what you're using, where you are, yeah, hate speech is not allowed. So check that out. You can't say just everything you want to say, period. But they don't want to see that. They don't want to believe it. It's kind of like when I was teaching, well, it is like when I was teaching at um, university. I had my students look it up, um, and they had a, it was a, uh, an assignment, and they had to look up what is not covered, and they had to turn it in. Well, the ones who did not want to believe it, they refused. They they would turn something in that was um, a confirmation bias, basically, what confirmed what they wanted to believe. I say until you turn it in as a sign, you you will have a big fat zero for that grade. You know, an F, some would say. They they would still turn it in, or they just wouldn't do it because they were refusing to believe anything other than they believed. It wasn't very many. No, that would be like a very small percentage that wanted to fight for their right to abuse. Okay, seriously, that's what it is, fighting for their right to abuse. They think they have a right to abuse. But, you know, depending on the time, depending on where you live, what is covered, what isn't, um, you know, but yeah, they didn't have that right. I mean, you know, these people I'm talking about, you really don't have a right to use hate speech. Um, you might think you do, <laughs> but but like I said, some kind of law, part of the law I had read at one point had changed. I can't verify that. Uh, so, yeah. This is what was involved with this kind of situation and it seemed to have gotten ugly. I don't think anybody was ever hurt or anything. Um, you know, I'm talking physically hurt or harmed or threatened or you know it was just kind of like I said bravado and all that um, you know bravado and a challenge that sounds like threats and it was threatened back you know but and it, and it does kind of worry me because the, the threats nobody should feel threatened you know just because they're making a video on a social media whether it's YouTube or any other one um, they shouldn't feel threatened because their views are different, but they also shouldn't threaten others because their views, you know, views are different, unless it is something that is very, very hurtful or harmful. Now, people can just have a difference in the way they see things. That's one thing. But to threaten somebody because their views aren't exactly like yours, but that person's views aren't abusive, 
you know, I don't believe in threatening anybody anyway. That's not, you know, that's not your job kind of thing. Yeah, unless it actually is. <laughs> but I don't know of any job that it, that is. But yeah, you know, threatening is should be crossed off. No, don't do it. Some people might think that this is the type of person who uh, <clears throat> got what she deserved. I, I don't like that. I think I mentioned that in a video, but I don't know if it's one I had to take down and all that. But I don't like that. I don't, you know, like to see somebody, you know, get what they deserve, what people say. Um, yeah, you know, that kind of mentality is not one of mine at all. So, but yeah, I'm glad that she learned from it. At least one. I don't know about, I don't even know who the other one is or the other ones are. I don't know. <clears throat> but yeah, at least one person may have learned. You know, but, but to have to be, to for somebody to force you to learn, that's not right either to me. Yeah, you know, it's one of those things where I'm afraid my mind's, you know, I'm so open-minded that my brain might fall out. Um, but yeah, I, I don't think anybody should be threatened. I don't think, you know, like that. I don't think anybody should be threatened. Like I just said. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up before I keep rambling. I think I need to eat. Yeah, I bought my lunch and I need to eat. <laughs> so, that could be the problem. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. What do you think before I go? Um, so, wrapping it up, if you want to subscribe, click the circle. If you're watching another video on this channel, click one of the rectangles. Like, subscribe, comment, and share if you would. And I'll talk to y'all on another video. Bye.